Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Season 2, Episode 4 of Soon Runes. It's going to get started in 3, 2, 1, go. We're, we're, we're just sewing the same thing from last week. I know, like clutch the pearls, oh my god. I mean, but hold up, is it any other competition coming up soon? Now, okay, I, I get it. As I was saying, like, before I started recording, um, was Masa had a reason to say that to Minato. Because, like, I think last week I kind of interpreted it as him being an ass and such. And then I think when I thought about it a couple of days after, um all the way to today i was like yeah there's got to be a reason he's also doing this and because he wants everybody to reevaluate what their weaknesses are and then try to be better at it but like i said like <laughs> ain't there another tournament coming up soon i mean unless we're going like what two three episodes without this and then we have a competition but i feel like minato might be depressed about this i, I really don't know I mean, th this is Mina Tober talking about, for Christ's sake. I mean, Jesus. So, excuse me. Um, who knows what he's going to be currently thinking about after now knowing, oh, hey, it's not what you think it is. Like, he's not doing this to be mean to you. Or, you know, especially with what happened, it's just for you to be better. That's all. <laughs> but everybody looking like, are you freaking kidding me? Like, what? <laughs> But, I mean, in, in Minato and everybody else's experience, like, this is a punishment. Oh, my God. Huh. Go ahead and put the whole freaking OST on YouTube or something, because, God, I can't. Or at least on iTunes. <laughs> god, he's so funny. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't with Sam. <laughs> Right? You guys should do something. <clears throat> you would think everybody, even Kai Time, be like, all right, we're taking a break. No more arrows, no more bows. Why are we here? But that's a struggle, man. Of 
course. Exactly, it's obvious. Like, he was coming from there, so what do you think he was doing? I just... Yeah, I mean, in a way, they're both art. Mm -hmm. And it takes time. Mm -hmm. But the whole team is beautiful. Like, Jesus. <laughs> Let me stop! Yeah, I mean, the way that you just drew that whole thing, World Heart, is like what your mind is thinking right now. Your mind is a jumbled mess. No, it's Minato there. Oh, he is. Oh. Uh, uh. Mm -mm. You watch. Seriously? Dude, that's what it looked like outside right here as of right now. It looks like it's gonna rain. Like extremely bad. <laughs> ah. mm. That's all. He's so pretty for the say, oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna go die now. Yo. Yeah. Oh. God damn it, Nikaido, stop it. You're making it worse.
Hmm. That makes sense. Comes the rain. Yes, even at school. God, they're all they're just so pretty. I cannot. This is too much. I. Mm. Like seriously. <laughs> Baby, he got super excited. Oh. <laughs> I mean, you're already here, so... Okay, that makes sense. <clears throat> like you kind of fill out the loop. Yeah. Were you thinking about something else? Yeah, I mean, this is a group discussion. But it seems like you are. Mm hmm Right? There's something, <clears throat> there's something on your mind, so just say it. Actually, this is just going to irritate me for the remainder of the episode. Exactly. So whatever it is, if it is maybe yourself. <clears throat> Chill. You yourself are holding yourself back. So sit and think about that. Call tough love. Does. Sometimes you can't stop them. Hmm? 
Mm-hmm. And that's really what's happening. <clears throat> Excuse me. Remember how you kept saying last week that it was all up to you, that everything of what happened in season one going on to this season, where everybody helped you when you were in your right, it switched where you feel like you need to have, help everyone. Because, of course, say it asked first. I want to see that. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah, not just his boyfriend. <laughs> Let me see the footage. <laughs> You're only mad because he was being honest and truthful to you yesterday. <laughs> but what he said was true. As much as you're denying it right now. So fucking cute. Exactly. Woo, this episode. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's hitting hard. You don't have to be perfect. Oh. But,
right? And a dojo, but you want to get to the top without both of those things, so. How can you be so sure about that? Like, yes, you guys are good. Oh, my God. But still. That we're already at the end of the episode. Oh my god, this episode goes like fucking quick. I love it though, but Jesus. <laughs> yes. We're already at the end. Oh my god. It goes too fast. Stop making him so pretty. I'm already, you are we already know I'm in love with this man. I've been in love with this man since season fucking one. You don't always have to be on your by yourself and alone anymore. You have everyone. Mm -hmm. Exactly. You guys are out of sync. And you need to be back in sync. What about? What? Well, I mean, you have to figure that out on your own. I can't just give you all the answers. My precious baby boy. Oh my god, I can't. <laughs> Oh, God. Just, it, it, this episode really just <clears throat> confirmed. I think everybody except Saya. Saya and, um, Saya now. Maybe now a little bit. I would have to go back and rewatch the previous episode and then, you know, probably rewatch this episode as well. But Rohe, Minato, and Kaito. All three of them are kind of, they are off on their game. And each one of them has something on their mind that is fucking you know, themselves over. With Minato, it's the strife of being um, perfect, just like Shu and Nikaido. And with Kaito, it, it's like, it, it, mm, God, with his is a little, it's a little hard to get. But I feel like, you know, I need a little more time with Kaito on his situation. But it's like, he, the pressure of waiting on Minato to go and then having to be like very how he was in this episode where it's like oh my god like Minato come on hurry up da 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 what's taking so long then also the um pressure of also wanting to be perfect and being like okay the team like I need to do this for the team just how Minato was like last week so it's very they're very similar in this situation with Rohe I feel like because of the fact is and the way his painting conveyed and the way, you know, he was shooting, his mind is a jumble mess right now. He has so many things possibly on his mind, not 100% sure, but he can't focus. And it seems like that also from Minato and Kaito, but with Seiya and um, now, they can't really, they seem fine. But as Masa said, you guys, and as I said, you're not really in sync. Season one, after, you know, the situation of Minato and stuff, and you five coming together as a group and winning, you that was when they were on sync. Now, it, it's very similar, and I kind of believe I'm going to compare this to this, but the way it's going, 
um, and how they're doing it is very similar to the entirety of IGPX. When you look at like for a twenty what twenty six episode series, is, even though they say it's season one, season two, it's one fucking season. I don't care what you tell me. Um, how when teams tell me one season one champions ish, and then you come in for the second half of season one or quote unquote season two, whatever you call it, and ish like that. And you have a lot more pressure on this group to win every single freaking match. And then plus, uh, what was that group? White Snow. Doing the ish that they were doing, aka cheating, but I didn't realize it was cheating until the last episode. Like, I don't think anybody is cheating. It's just the things that Team Satomi went through. So their mental issues, the situation with the group together, um... Amy getting her, all those other things are very similar to what is going on with Minato and friends. They have so many things on their mind and they're not synced up as a group that because of the fact is that's kind of the reason why they lost last week. Because everybody is like not in the loop, we're not synced up and so it, we need a moment where everyone is able to come back together and resync. Now, do I think Minato is still going to be on the rubber band for another week? Maybe so. I feel like we're going to go into next week and he's still going to be using that rubber band, of course. And then maybe Masa might be like, okay, Minato, come on. <laughs> come back to the big leaves and um, use a bow. Um, I'm also hoping that next week the girls also get more focus because... I need them to get more focus. I mean, yeah, season one, they got that focus from what I remember as such. And then, you know, the three of them are having a conversation about a public tournament and how they want to do it. And I think that is a really good idea, not only for them, but then I also thought that say it would have been like, oh, hey, that's a good idea. Let's also try that as well, even though it's five guys only three can do it and then the other one will be two unless you know Moss is like hey you know let me do something too but that didn't happen <laughs> unfortunately um as for Nikaido's group I, I okay I get the fact that Nikaido is like I want to get to the top by ourselves with no help from the school um no uh instructor no dojo dojo just us as a group so that we can prove how good we are and such but then at the same time i feel like that's gonna be his downfall and such like yes that whole his whole team is good as fuck i love the fact that he is also you know even though he's not the captain that's more about Garagi, who is fine as fuck <laughs> um he, but he will tell it like it is as he is the leader. Because technically, in a way, even though, like I said, Akaragi is the captain, Nikaido is, like, the leader of the group, and he will still tell everything like it freaking is. So once again, he will go back and forth between Lelouch B. Vitania and then freaking Joker from Persona 5. He's going back and forth between it. Once he is literally over here saying, such and such, you're doing this, that's Joker. That is Joker from Persona 5. I don't care what you tell me. But when he does that voice change, goodbye. Goodbye to my sanity. I am done. But going uh, really after going after that, <laughs> I just need to bring that up. Um, I just feel like as of right now, with the one other person who he was just talking to in this episode, I want him to bring him on as an instructor, but at the same time, because he is so, I'd rather do this all on my own. I don't, like, he, he wants to be independent. He doesn't want to have anyone else on him. I get it. I completely understand that, too, but there's nothing wrong without getting extra help and such. You can't always do everything on your own. This is the same thing of what I was talking about, like, with season one, you know, and even continuing now and such. You can't always do everything by yourself. That's the same thing with Kaito. Kaito really has to sit and think about what else is troubling him besides what we just saw in this episode. So hopefully next week we get a little more into that. But yeah, I mean, it was a good episode. Very, very good. Very pretty, of course. Good behind OST that I need on iTunes. Now, 
please and thank you. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode four of season two of Sinrin. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Wednesday for episode five. Bye, guys.